agreed. I'd been over the hip in one day. Here it is on Sunday. So we come out with a brush with a jug in each pocket. And it came up raining about the same time. So we ran into church. And <laughs> drank what was in the bottle. You know, it was for the people. We sold all we had in the pocket. I don't believe it. Is that true? <laughs> yeah, it take one whiff of that stuff. It sold. In the church? Right in the church. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, you call it hooch. Yeah. That's what you call it. Okay. Call Hooch. What? The the alcohol. And he sold all the hooch. But most of it they took across the river to sell because the revenue of the island on this side of the river was was meaner. Just come out of the seas. I, Bought a whole, whole fifth, and we sat down, got drunk as a skunk. You and Jesse? Yeah. <laughs> My mother didn't come out and say, I'm down to I don't remember. No fool. Somebody told me he froze to death. Oh, you're kidding. That's yeah. how he died. I guess they'd been working at a still. Most of the night, the wee wee hours, we got finished. And uh, he was near this black people's church over there on the Weaver's Road. You know where the Weaver's Road is? Did you ever go with Granddaddy when he delivered mail? That was his substitute. After he I brought that old student bacon to hell and back a lot of times. <laughs> yeah. That was after you were in the army, right? No, it was before. Before you went in the army? Yeah. Well, didn't you work with him some after you came out with the army? Yeah. I took over the week at the time I was checking out because he was getting so It was too much on him. Yeah. And we used to go over and catch the wild horses and ride the sound guns <laughs> until one poor devil fell off and just about busted his neck. The school we went to, the little one room schoolhouse, did you go to that? I did. We, we went, Mother and I went in there, and the people let us, the people who were living, there's a family living there now, mm -hmm. and they let us go through. What? <laughs> How long did you go there? Uh, first grade, yeah. First and second. Uh, I went to. I went there. In the morning, we just frost on the ground and barefoot. Build up the fire in it, the stove, <laughs> throw it out before the school guy. Why did you go barefoot? Is that a mixture? Because wore out your darn shoes. So you'd, you'd go in and build the fire? You'd build the fire? Yeah, sometimes I'd have someone else there. Yeah, you get started. Give you some matches to start it with. Oh, I am most of the time. I don't know where the heck that come from. Didn't care. And, and you were in the second grade of yeah, that time? Yeah, that one road goes down the way, one goes this way. Yeah. This one goes to Grandpa's mill, the one that goes left. Mm -hmm. It was real rocky. Do you remember being out of school? What year you were out of school? Because you yeah, were sick. Yeah, we fourth and fifth grade. After that started at Little Town. 
She had to walk five miles and ride a, ride a, ride a horse. <laughs> when we rode the mule, mule, excuse me, was oh. when, when the water got up so high. Yeah, I <laughs> couldn't, cross, <laughs> come, couldn't cross a creek. <laughs> and the mule would be swimming when he went across when we were on the back. <laughs> it was real, a real steep hill, and the creek was down at the base of it. And when it rained, it, it had to fill up. The, you know, couldn't go all down at the same time. Yeah. Well, Reeve, we went to see. Mom went to see. I went with you to see Reeve about I don't know six months ago. Yeah. She went to doctor's back. I ain't cooked. You talking about me? No, no. Reeve too. No, Ruby, Ruby Salmon, Ruby made Ruby is Ruby's mother, and she married Jesse Salmon. Yeah, he died that time. Yeah, he's Come been dead. Come home from the army or something. But I thought they ain't cooked. Maybe he adopted her. <coughs> what happened was but Ruby's mother decided to go to New York and go to work. And she got a cook to take Ruby. Because Ruby was probably four or five years old or so, maybe not maybe younger than that, I don't know. And take care of her and she stayed with Aunt Cook the rest of her life. Oh, I didn't know that. She she was a uh, Aunt Pat's daughter, Ruby's mother. Yeah, Aunt yes, Pat's I daughter. Remember, Aunt hey, hey, Pat, Aunt hey, Cook, was his sister, and was Granddaddy Sharon's sister, yes. and Uncle Frank's sister. <laughs> you surely remember Uncle Frank. A little bit older, because <laughs> I was. Taking care of a bunch of uh, rabbit traps in the morning. I, you know, get a rabbit or two. And you weren't doing that when you were sick, though. Yes, I was. I don't know. I could just could, could lift the egg on the hang of it. Get the rabbit without him getting away. Well, you are one lucky person to live through that. You know, Mama, Mama tells me a story all the time about you being sick, so sick, and then the doctor saying, tell yourself. He told Mama when you were there with your uniform on. Uh, before you left in the army, that he saw you out on the street and he told Mama 
that he never expected to see that. He didn't think he was going to make it. Dr. Browning said I would live to be 20.